Is that two? Oh, that's two. The flight kicked to the left. Ah, almost. <laughs> you guys ready for this one? The Loxley Christian Kissed Darts Review begins right now. Okay, here we go. It is darts review time. I've got a great video planned for you today. I think you're all going to enjoy this one. Now, I'm going to start with this right out of the gate. I think we can all agree there's a lot of companies out there making some incredible darts, but I don't know what it is with Loxley. It seems like they've stepped their game up even further. They've been coming out with some unbelievable darts recently. Now, check this out. I still have the Mustangs, which I have to review. So that review is coming soon. If you guys remember just going back, I don't know, a couple weeks ago, I reviewed, I'll put the thumbnail up over here. I reviewed the Scott Baker darts, one of my all time favorite front loaded darts. What an amazing set there. And in today's video, I'll be reviewing another set of front loaded darts. This time it is the Loxley Christian Kiss darts. Now you guys remember going back, it's been a dozen years now, believe it or not, 12 years since he hit that winning shot to win the BDO World Championships. Yeah, I can't, I can't believe how quickly time goes by, but yeah, it's been 12 years since he won the BDO title back in 2012. And uh, today we're gonna be checking out his brand new darts from Loxley. These are the lipstick darts. Now I happen to pick them up at Dart Center. What a great shop. Their, their shipping to the United States has been pretty quick. I've got no complaints there. I'm gonna put a screenshot up over here and that's uh, a shot of their website. Now these darts, they come in 22, 23, and 24 grams. And you guys know I went with the lightest version available. I generally do that. I just prefer lighter darts. So yeah, we got the 22 gram version here. I'm gonna have a link down below in the pinned comments. Gonna take you over to Dart Center and check them out, guys. Not only do they have the entire lineup of Loxley darts, they also have some prototype darts that you're not gonna find anywhere else. So yeah, check them out. Dart Center, again, link down below in the pinned comment. But hey, let's get into it. I don't want to keep you waiting. We got a great set here to review. Here we go. Loxley Christian Kissed. Here we go. Okay, guys, let me show you what we've got going on here, starting with the packaging, and then we'll take a quick peek at the darts. But you know what? Other companies could learn a little bit from Loxley here. I've mentioned this in other reviews, but if you're a sponsored player, the least that the company could do is put your picture on the packaging. So um, yeah, Loxley is always pretty good with that. So nice to see Christian's picture there. On the back, we have Loxley's mission statement, or I guess their philosophy. You can go ahead and pause the video and read all of that if you want. But um, yeah, nice, bright, compact packaging. Quite like it. However, I think we're more dedicated players here on this channel. We come to see the darts. And there they are. How is that? Pretty awesome, right? So you see the lipstick logo there on the back end. That's what all this grip is meant to represent. Lipstick. So kind of like little tiny mouths all around the barrel. How awesome is that? And as you can see, definitely front loaded as well. Very ever so slightly front loaded. That is not a straight barrel dart. You can see where it bulb, I guess it's bulbous on the front end. So um, yeah, very nice. Black points up front. We've got the Loxley nylon stem on the back. This is a medium. So it's 48.5 millimeters, not including the threads. And on the back end, we've got the Loxley Lipstick Standard Size Flights. And I forgot to buy an extra set, so this is the only set that I have. But there's the darts. Man, I quite like those, huh? How awesome is that? Well, let's go into the next clip, and I'll hit you with all the stats and dimensions. Here we go. Okay, guys, here we go. Getting underway with the Loxley Christian Kiss Darts. And I tell you what. The more that I look at these things, the more that I absolutely love them. What a great, great set of barrels here, isn't it? Now we're gonna start with the points. Come on, we always do that, right? But yeah, we're gonna start with the points. These come with a set of 35 millimeter black coated points, just a generic set of points. These protrude out of the front of the barrel, 29 millimeters. Now, as far as the barrels go, these are 90% tungsten. The barrel length coming in at 48.2 millimeters long and the barrel width at the widest point, this entire front section, 6.95 millimeters wide. However, for those rear grippers out there, super skinny on the back end at only six millimeters wide. So all kind of depends on where you grip these barrels. 
Now I did unscrew the stem, checked out the drill depth, and these are drilled out 12.7 millimeters deep in the back end. And as far as the match weight goes, I bought the 22 gram version, almost perfect here. Two of the barrels, 22.08, and finally that third barrel swinging around the corner, 22.09 grams. How is that for some match weight, right? One one hundredth of a gram off. Excellent job, Loxley. Incredible quality control. But let's go into the next clip and tell you all about this lipstick grip. Okay, here we go. Let me hit you with a quick grip level here. And I think this is one of those barrels you can just look at and safely say it's going to be a very low level grip. And you'd be 100% correct. Very mild grip here for sure. I'm going to go ahead and get that right out of the way and say grip level two on a scale of one to five. But I tell you what, all these little miniature lips that are milled into the barrel has such a unique feel to it. I'm not really sure what else to compare it to except to say, man, they feel incredible. They really do. Starting all the way in the front, this grip goes all the way to the back. Yeah, it's such a unique, consistent feel to it. But here's what I really like about this barrel. We've got the raised section up front, right? So slightly front loaded right there, right where it starts to gradually taper towards the back. There's a little hump right there. That's where my thumb is going to go with my pointer finger right on top. And that's going to make for such a repeatable grip. Now you can grip them on the flat raised part here. So you can be a front gripper, me in the middle, or you could grip on the skinny section all the way in the back. So many options there, but yeah, I'm going to go for the repeatable grip kind of right, right there. So cannot wait to throw these things. Now here's the issue. we got a little lip on the front like most darts do. So let me take care of that with a Trident 180 nose cone. So that solves that problem. And like I said, I forgot to buy an extra set of flights. So I don't want to be bashing on these beautiful Loxley flights. So there we go, guys. I'll probably throw it just like that. So uh, let's get these things on the board and see how they fly. Here we go. Oh boy, so I'm not too sure how this is gonna go. Let me explain, but firstly, I decided to go with a completely stock setup as they came out of the package. The only thing I added, of course, the Trident 180 nose cones. And again, that's because I only have one set of flights. So here's the problem tonight. I'm not too, how, I'm not too sure how well I'm gonna throw here. Here's what I did. I filmed the rest of this video earlier today. As you can see with the clock, it was a few hours ago. I took a break. I went to the gym. I, I trained chest and triceps. My triceps are absolutely shattered. I think a lot of you guys know, you know, doing any sort of physical activity like that and trying to play darts. Nah, it doesn't mix too well, does it? However, I am seven weeks away from a bench press contest. Kind of, um, kind of stepped up the training a little bit. So yeah, seven weeks away from that. But uh, yeah, who cares about that? Let's see how these darts fly. Although, I do have to brag a little bit. Earlier today, after I finished, you know, filming all the close-ups and things like that, I threw them, hit my first 180 in about two minutes. I backed it up with a 20, a 5, and a treble 19, so that's 82. Then I hit another 180, and I'm like, oh man, let me turn the camera on real quick. I had to hit the 180 that you're about to watch. And that took, I think it was like a minute 48 or a minute 58. Well, you're about to see here in just a second. So three 180s in the span of about three minutes. So that was earlier today when I could actually feel my arms. Ah, 60, hey, three straight ones. That was uh, better than what my warm-ups were. No, but honestly, um, earlier today, yeah, they were flying incredibly well. I was, I was probably playing better than I had played in a little while. Uh, tonight, though, we'll see what happens. Oh, hey, <laughs> we'll take it. Yeah, honestly, my arms are shaking. This is kind of funny. 100, hey, not too bad. So... The big thing I noticed with these darts, you know how smooth barrel darts, once they warm up to your, or once the barrels warm up to your fingertips, they get a little more grippy, a little more sticky. That's exactly what these things are doing. So the grip improves as the barrel warms to your fingertips. That's a good thing, right? But yeah, they, they don't offer a lot of grip, but I cannot state just how nice they feel. They really do ever so slightly front loaded. If you'll notice, they're standing up in the board just a little bit, not too extreme. 
And honestly, I really don't like a medium stem, but man, they work perfect with these darts. Whew. 95. And of course, yeah, had to get that treble five in there, right? Whew. All right. Eesh. And like I said, I'm gripping right on that one spot where it feels like I'm almost pushing this barrel. So yeah, I mean, they, I love the grip. I honestly do. Ah, oh, there's a treble five again. Hey, at least I got the one treble 20 in. Dropping one treble per turn. All right, that was four. Let's, let's make this the last turn and get out of here. Oh, I think I can, well, normally I could get over that one. Yeah, I just got no, no control here. All right, feather it in there. Oh, 60, one more, we'll do one more. I thought I could drop that one in. All right, we'll do one last one, six throws today. The darts feel so nice, I wanna do them justice by Throwing well, but it doesn't always happen. Yeah. All right, we'll end with a 140. I'm glad I took that extra turn. Also bumps the average up a little bit, doesn't it? All right, whew, all right. Well, I think I got out of that one pretty good. I think the average was respectable considering. So, hey, that made my night. Um, yeah, great set of darts. They were much more fun to throw earlier today when I felt good, but hey, that wasn't too bad. So I'm in a good mood. And again, man, I just absolutely love these things. I know I say that about a lot of Lox, uh, Loxley darts, the Scott Bakers that I have behind me, and uh, these just about equally as nice. Wow, what a great, great set of darts. But let's roll into the 180, and look how tight, I think it was the first and second dart, the points pretty much touching. So great 180, and we'll wrap this thing up and get out of here. Let's go. That's awkward. I think that's in. Oh, how tight is darts number one and two? Boom. Hey, that wasn't too bad. I was warming up and I hit two 180s off camera. I've been recording now for a minute, 49.50. 51 so we'll take that well that's gonna wrap it up guys hope you enjoyed the close-up look and review of the loxley christian kiss darts what an amazing set here reminder link down below is gonna take you over to dart center have a look around and again don't forget about those prototype loxley's some amazing stuff that you won't see anywhere else but if you did enjoy the video thumbs up always appreciated but you guys know what i always say here leave a comment down below let me know what you thought of the video let me know what you think of these darts and if you plan on possibly getting them here in the near future. But now comes the time of the video where I give these a recommendation on how well I think they're going to work for a recreational player. Man, there's a lot to like here, right? Nice mild grip, consistent grip level. And if you enjoy a slightly front loaded dart, I think these are going to fit the bill. They come in 22, 23 and 24 grams. So that covers a wide variety there. And I'll just cut to the chase. They're gonna get a pretty good score here. And let me know what you think about this. 8.9 out of 10. So that's gonna do it for the video, guys. Again, hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, we'll see you on the next video. Later. Okay, so eBay is terrible. The fees are absolutely outrageous. So if you're in the United States and you wanna purchase the darts I just reviewed or any of the other darts, have a look down in the description box. I'll have all the darts listed as well as my business email. Give me a shout and we'll get the darts sent out to you right away. See you in the next video, guys. Later.